most demanding spaces to organize in a kitchen is a corner cabinet. While it doubles the storage capacity behind a single door, the items are tough to access. As a result, it's usually delegated to store things that we need the least or simply ignore. They become dead zones in your kitchen. Well, you can say goodbye to all of that with these 12 corner cabinet organization ideas from SimpHome.com. One of them should be the perfect solution for you. Number 12. The Rev a Shelf Blind Corner Cabinet. The blind corner cabinet from Reva Shelf has an ingenious sliding mechanism that lets you pull the first rack out, then slide it to the right. As you're doing that, it's also pulling a corner rack to the right, whose contents you can now easily access. Gone are the days when you have to squat, stick your arm and your head in to find and get what you need. It's a terrific way to maximize that often neglected area. Installation is straightforward and you can do it on the right or left cabinets. It would be ideal in small kitchens where every inch of space counts. 11. DIY Pull-Out Shelves You need to get two sets of bottom-mounted drawer slides for the bottom shelf and two standard sets for the other one. Proceed to mount those half-inch plywood pull-out shelves in the corner area. Next, you need two heavy-duty full-extension side rails. Flatten the end stop so you can separate the rail pieces. With plywood and some 2 by 2 inch wood, build an open rack 3 inches narrower than the opening with one closed side for where you'll mount it. Attach four small casters. Cut another plywood piece that's 5 and a half inches wide to the height of the rack. Mount it to the cabinet side with the bottom and top rails. Cut two 4 inch boards with the same height and attach them with piano hinges. Attach them to the piece on the rails with piano hinges, but on the side opposite of the first hinge. Finally, on the other end, attach the solid front side of the rack with piano hinges, also opposite the first hinge. 10. Conceal your trash bin. This under-the-cabinet trash bin from the bin company is a truly great find. It consists of a quarter-round shaped heavy-duty rack that swings on a post. Inside this rack, you can place three custom-shaped bins. They're excellent for separating and sorting your trash. The cabinet door doesn't carry the load and only helps pivot the rack out. There's also a single lid that conveniently covers all the bins when you close the door. 9. Floating Shelves Makeover Idea you want a kitchen with a more open and airy feel, you can go with floating shelves instead of top cabinets. However, this style would require your items to be presentable. No canned goods or boxes of cereal should grace these shelves, but you can always store them in the lower counter cabinets. A viable container option for this type of storage is attractive looking glass jars, and you'll need plenty of them. You can dedicate the top shelves to only display decorative items like beautiful earthen jars and pots. For the look, it's ideal to have a similar looking counter that matches the shelves to a T. I recommend a rich colored natural wood finish to give the shelves and countertop a timeless appeal. 8. Hide the condiments That cabinet space under your sink can be an excellent location to store all your condiments. A handy option is these side mounted and sliding storage bins. They slide on rails and there are stoppers to prevent them from dropping. The bins are about 37.6 centimeters long, 15.2 centimeters wide, and 10.5 centimeters high. They're rated up to 5 kilograms and are perfect for storing your condiments, detergents, and other kitchen cleaning items. They come with adhesive strips, which make them a breeze to install. All you need to do is to slide them back to their rails. You then attach the adhesives, peel off the protective plastic, and press them to the side of a cabinet. 7. Magic Corner Drawer Idea Another brilliant corner cabinet solution comes in the way of a diagonally sliding corner cabinet. This system combines two corner cabinet drawers into a big one that goes in and out sideways. While they don't maximize the use of that L-shaped corner space, they do a better job than a typical drawer layout and are far more convenient. There are no corner seams on the L-shaped faces. They also come with various drawer organizers to keep everything neat and tidy. 6. Kitchen Corner Utilities Another space that's often overlooked or underutilized is the inside corner above a countertop. You can place different items there that are not only functional but are also decorative. Take this large tool caddy, for instance. It could house your breadboards, rolling pins, jars, you name it, and it'll give that corner a rustic charm. 
you could also place a small lamp to brighten up a lifeless corner, or maybe even turn a shiny wine chiller to an attractive kitchen utensil holder. You can't go wrong with beautiful flowers and vases, and they'll pop against a corner backsplash. 5. Vertical Lift Door Project Idea People sometimes extend a top cabinet down towards the countertop to conceal some items. However, you may not want its doors swinging over the surface. Our ingenious solution is a vertical lift door. Instead of pivoting it, you pull the door towards you and lift it fully on specially designed hinges. It will be an ideal storage space to put your blender, mixer, or even your toaster away. It's a terrific idea that will help declutter your countertops even further. For these cabinet door types, it's more ergonomic to put the handles on the bottom frame. 4. Double Basin Sink Double sinks are typical in layouts of many home kitchens, but sometimes they take up too much space on the counter, and there's nowhere left to put a built-in dishwasher near it. But there's a type of double sink that would be excellent for small kitchens with narrow countertop spaces, and will take care of your dishwasher dilemma. It's called a corner-mounted double sink, and they won't take up much width on either side of the L-shape. And since it's in a corner, you'll get ample bonus space at the back of this sink where you can adorn it with plants or put a soap holder. 3. Craft this DIY corner cabinet idea An excellent option for bare kitchen corners would be a DIY open corner cabinet with a small triangular footprint. With half-inch plywood, cut the sides of the cabinet. Make sure the other one is a half an inch wider. Cut the outer edges and give them a 45-degree miter. Join the flat edges with glue and brads. Make sure they're square at a 90-degree angle. Cut the top and bottom right triangles from the plywood and attach them to the sidings. From the inside, measure the width from the corner up to the inside miter cut. Again, cut the triangle shelf sides to this length and install them. You can put some trim on the front edges of the shelves to hide the plies. The face frame is 1 by 3 inch lumber that's mitered 45 degrees on the outside. Glue a simple crown molding at the top to earn more style points. If it's a floor cabinet, mount it on a 1 by 4 inch triangle base. Or if you have some extra cabinet legs lying around, you can attach three of them to the bottom. Apply the finish and that's it. 2. Plate Drawer Idea Here's another ingenious solution. This time, it's for organizing and securing stacks of different sizes of plates in the corner china drawer. It will keep them from moving around. This one has a pegboard design, and the pegs used are dowel-sized. They're tall enough so that four to five pegs can secure a stack of 12 plates. It's perfect for homeowners who live in quake-prone areas to prevent the dishes from being jostled by trimmers. It also provides a means to sort your plates by type and size. Before I wrap this list up, thanks for keeping playing this video. If you like what you see, care to support this channel by pressing the subscribe button under the video. It benefits nearly half dozens of people working behind the video. And let's return to our final countdown. Lastly, number one, corner pantry idea. Probably one of the most underrated storage solutions is corner pantries. This one takes up the space of the counter and four corner cabinets. It uses a diagonally placed door, which adds even more room inside. You arrange the shelves in a recessed L configuration, and there will still be some dead space in the corner. However, it's more efficient and accessible than a typical layout. And you can quickly see which items went where. Conclusion With so many ideas being tossed around, it's sometimes hard to make sense of it all and decide which ones to pick. The concepts, products, and DIY tasks I presented here merely scratch the surface. However, they are all tried and tested to work, and there are choices for different sizes of kitchens and wallets. Don't hesitate to visit SempHome.com to read the full article and find more home improvement tips. That's it for now. Before this video ends, feel free to use a comment area to express your thoughts or reactions. Like or share it with anyone close to you in social media if you think the video deserves more attention. I hope you enjoy your stay, and until we meet again later sometime in the future, have a good day and stay safe.